Hi, I'm Dean Maltz, partner of Shigerban Architects here in New York City. Welcome to the Cast Iron House in the heart of Tribeca. The Cast Iron House was originally built in 1882. It's on the National Registry of Historic Places. It's a standalone New York City landmark. It's one of the great examples of cast iron architecture in New York City and perhaps around the world. Let's head to the penthouse. This 3,800 square foot duplex was actually added to the top of the original cast iron structure. Here we are in the foyer. From the moment you step off the elevator, you feel a sense of calm, as if you've entered into another world far away from New York City. Just listen. Could you hear the sense of calm? It's so quiet. It's almost like you've been swept away to a tropical island. We at Chigarban strive for a world-class architecture that is innovative, sustainable, and solves problems. So one of the problems here was to create a two-story addition when landmark buildings usually allow only one story. We solved that by setting the addition back from the facade, thereby creating an illusion of a one-story addition. But here in the living room, you really get the sense of scale and volume of a two-story home. But what is particularly unique is that there are no columns to interrupt your view. That is made possible by this very little truss that is cantilevered from the back of the building. Architectural innovation is one thing, but how does the living room really feel? I can tell you, no matter where you sit, it's comfortable, bright, and of course, airy. And to open these sliding glass doors on a summer day is an experience like none other. And the 1,500 square foot terrace wraps around the north and east side of the apartment becoming an extension of the interior living spaces, where you could lounge or dine under the New York City sky. Trust me, there's plenty of room to entertain on the grandest of scales. We designed this kitchen to be minimal, not to distract you from the views and the beautiful furnishings throughout the rest of the apartment. But because it's open and continuous to the rest of the space, it had to have a continuity of style. The design of the kitchen has a palette of off-whites with lacquer cabinets, marble countertop, and a frosted glass backsplash. Here's our signature style cabinets with no hardware. It has a single pull that allows you to open a drawer and open a door. No hardware makes for a cleaner, streamlined look. As you come upstairs past the spare bedrooms, you are drawn into the primary suite by the natural light. What's amazing about this space is that you could lie in bed and enjoy the same views that you had from the living room space. These sliding glass doors allow for privacy and transparency. It's a continuity of the design language of the sliding doors downstairs. But when it's open, it gives you the ability to look down and greet your guests. It's also an homage to the traditional Tribeca loft. There's plenty of storage up here, as you could see and the curved corners facilitate an easy flow from the bedroom to the dressing room to the bathroom. And finally, to warm things up in the bedroom, we used oak on the floors. This is definitely one of the most unique bedrooms we've ever designed. And unique architecture is something we always strive for. This project was a fantastic opportunity to add a new landmark on an existing landmark and to contribute to the architectural language of this amazing city. Thank you for coming. Can't get enough of these breathtaking homes? Hit that subscribe button for more open house coming your way.